in an unknown location. Ha 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 ha, I have finally completed the final part of the Twilight series. Now all there is to do is ship it and that Stephen King will be finished for good. How dare he mock my writing? I mean it's not, as if I write my books for fat emo 14 year old girls to read and fantasize about a non-existing sparkly vampire that's a complete and total fag. I write the books for myself and to express my imagination. Anyways the book should be shipped out by tomorrow morning. Later that night, on board the delivery plane. Well, I can't believe we are delivering the worlds to me, this selling book. Yeah, I mean there's absolutely nothing that can go wrong, and even if something does, Edward Cullen will use his hot 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 vampire powers to protect us. Wait, what was that noise I just heard? You two just made the worst mistakes of your lives by saying that! Holy shit, I have a I saw you we are both dead. Several hours later. In other news, the plane carrying the first shipment of the new addition to the Twilight series was found crashed in a nearby bay today. The pilots were found dead. One was shot and the other was slashed open from what appeared to be a sword. More news on this at 11. Back at the unknown location a few days later. What the fuck is this shit? Now I need to send out more copies of the book. Because some ugly fat non Twilight fan got in my way. What a stupid poopy head. How dare somebody try and stop me attempt to relieve my childhood by writing books for 10 year old girls. Wait what the fuck was that noise? I think I heard a window or something break. Surprise, you miss me? Fuck, not you again. Haven't you caused enough trouble when you killed everyone that went to the Twilight launch event for my first book? Let me think about that. Nah, that was nothing compared to this. Ah. In fact this is probably the best deed I've ever done for mankind. Say Miss Meyer you know you could just give up right now and I wouldn't have to kill you. I mean we can go eat tacos, you would pay of course. But we could just go out and have a nice lunch together, then haul you to the county prison, for your crimes against humanity, with your god-awful book. What do you say? I see you have to answer to me, Edward Cullen. While you were acting like a total poopy head, the best author in the world was running off and now you'll have to go through me to get to her. She opened a portal from inside the Twilight book, so, if I need reinforcements I want Cassidy to call, so let's get this shit on. Ha ha ha, bang, and he's dead. One clean shot between the eyes. Now you need to deal with us, the entire Cullen family. For Cullen Edward we are going to blind you with our sparkly skin and act nothing like how a real vampire would act. So let's begin now. Fuck you, I absorbed from my shades and fail. And I don't think I can carry on anymore you knew. I can't die just yet, but wait, could that be who I think it is? Yes, it's me Stephen King and I just got back from my countrywide twilight trolling session. It seems you need some help Deadpool, so now I will use the powers of real talent and the ability to write books for an audience that's older than 14. And here it goes, <laughs> and all the Cullens are now dead. Thanks Jane, but what about the fat bitch? <laughs> I already have her taken care of. In a far off location. Ha 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 ha, I escaped that faggot Deadpool, I'm sure Edward made quick work of him and I finally can get back to shipping copies of my new book. Fuck no you won't, not on my watch, my name is Ed and boy are you in for a treat, I'm the best clown in town however I'm not going to entertain or eat you, I am going to kill you. And here we go, and now she's dead and the world is saved.